Hello, welcome to NetApp KB TV. Today we will be talking about data infrastructure insight, a tool that empowers you with the knowledge about your data, ensuring that you're always informed and one step ahead. NetApp Data Infrastructure Insight is not just a service, it's a SaaS-based solution by NetApp, leveraging artificial intelligence and machine learning for today's hybrid multi-cloud environment. It's your go-to solution for continuous monitoring, optimization, and troubleshooting. Now let's work you through its main use cases. Let's start by exploring its core functionalities. That is, the first one being the real-time visibility, instantaneous issue detection for swift troubleshooting and resolution. It helps in performance optimization by pinpointing the root cause of the issue with the workload app tailored to the components monitored on Cloud Insights. Next being its flexibility and customizability. It tailors your analysis to specific needs, whether it's traffic uh, application risks or system calls. Data Infrastructure Insight adapts to your evolving platform requirements. Now let's jump on to a hands-on demonstration of the product where we will be covering about dashboards on monitoring and optimization, alerts, annotations, workload security, and Data Infrastructure Insight licensing. So we provide a large number of out-of-the-box dashboard that helps you visualize all the acquired information and they can be adjusted to your specific needs or even created one from scratch. So this dashboard helps you answer your key question in your environment. Where there is latency, where is there high demand and where is there saturation? So the primary objective is to quickly identify which storage nodes are in high demand and determine how to reallocate the workloads between them. And the data can be visualized to look at in different timelines, like 15 minutes, 30 minutes, 60 minutes, and so on. So here's another dashboard that gives you the same kind of data and understanding, but at the storage pool level. Let's have a look at another dashboard about optimization. So as you can see here, we have acquired stats and counters from multiple places like AWS, GCP, Azure, etc. So we all know that if the virtual machines are turned off, there is no cost associated with it. But if there's any kind of capacity that is associated with them, it's unfortunately not. So here we have list of virtual machine that are turned off, but there is some kind of capacity that's associated with them. So those GB will cost us money every day they are existing. So here you are able to see how much of the cost can be saved in total. So here's another dashboard that's gathered all information to have a holistic overview of your AWS environment. Total number of uh, EC2 instances, total number of vCPU count, in AWS and the total number of VRAM and the number of powered off, uh, powered off virtual machines, right? So to focus on optimization and reclamation, let's have a closer look at these two graphs, right? So these are all the instances where it's experiencing CPU utilization that's less than five or 10%. But if you have a closer look, they all belong to a larger instance. So these are the right candidate that could be moved to a smaller one. So now you can start right sizing to reduce waste and also stop over positioning.
So monitors allow you to set thresholds on metrics, right? So these metric monitors alert you when the warning level or critical level are crossed. So you can set up alerts to be notified via an email or you can have it integrated with a third party ticketing tool like Snow to receive alerts. So you can set up alerts on all of these objects that is shown here. For instance, let's take storage and these are the metrics that's available that's related to storage upon which you can set up an alert. So for um, demo purpose, let's choose IOPS and you can even filter it by an attribute or filter it by the metric and we're grouping it by the storage and you can set up a warning limit and also a critical limit that is based or that's according to your environment. And this option lets you avoid some unnecessary noise. So you get alerted only if it has sustained for over a period of time, be it one minute or five minutes or 10 minutes. You can set that up based on your requirement. And the delivery method could be an email or webhook as I mentioned and you can provide a short description about any kind of troubleshooting first level investigation the team who receives the alert can take right so these alerts helped you be proactive in nature about your environment Let's talk about workload security, which helps you protect your data with actionable intelligence on insider threat as well as ransomware attack. So it helps in monitoring the user activity. It reads the user activity across on-prem and hybrid cloud environment and draws a pattern around it and alerts you when there's any abnormal data access through advanced machine learning and anomaly detection of the user behavior, right? And it not just alerts you, but also takes an action to protect the data. So this is done by triggering a snapshot or restricting the user access in event of an attack or abnormal behavior. And it also provides forensics of what files were accessed, what action was taken by the attacker or the user and who accessed them and how many files were accessed. So we have two editions available for this product that is basic and premium. So you can choose the right fit for your business with a basic or premium edition. So uh, we will break it down the features and the benefits of each. So that is uh, with the basic, you get to monitor only NetApp. Uh, with premium, you get to monitor your multi-vendor entire holistic environment under a single umbrella. And the data retention in terms of basic is just seven days. And uh, with respect to premium edition, we the data retention is up to 13 months. So our professional services team is committed to ensuring that Data infrastructure insight is configured to industry best practices, maximizing your investments written. So thank you for tuning into NetApp KBTV as we explore the world of data infrastructure insights. Keep watching for further valuable information and don't forget to subscribe to NetApp KBTV for additional informative content. The better you understand your data, the better your decision making can be. Thank you.